Okay, so I think I speak on behalf of everyone when I say it would be such an interesting concept to see what it would be like if Moro actually invaded Universe 6. What is going on, Dragon Ball fans? Welcome back to another episode of Dragon Ball Universe 2 Mods, introducing Moro vs. Universe 6. Can you imagine that, right? I know you guys came here based off of the thumbnail you guys have seen, because the thumbnail is fire. Can you imagine Moro vs. Kefla, Super Saiyan 3 at that? Moro vs. Hit, and I had some very interesting fan manga ideas that I wanted to run by you guys. So, let's not waste any more time. I wanted to go ahead and feature Moro actually teaming up with Frieza. Now, I, I don't know why. I think these two really work well together, or at least they could, because they're both strong and they're both really, really evil. So, Moro and Frieza are going to battle against none other than the thumbnail leader herself, Super Saiyan 3. Kefla, can you, I mean, my god. Can you imagine the power, right? So, Super Saiyan 3 Kefla and her partner, Universe 6's Mightiest Assassin, hits. Now, I mean, I think between the two, this would be a, a spectacular showcase. But in the end, I do want to get your feedback on what would happen if Moro faced off against a potential Super Saiyan 3 Kefla, or if Moro even came across Hit. Do you guys think that maybe Hit possesses the necessary skill set to kill Moro if he were to incorporate those kind of techniques and abilities, or do you guys think that Moro would completely just eviscerate everybody? So again, if of course you guys are new, smash that like button down below, hit that subscribe button. Again, the more, the, I think the most important thing is to, is to smash that like button down below. Now, here is my proposal. Now, I wanted to ask you guys, what did you guys want to see if I were to do a fan manga involving said characters? Would you guys rather see Moro versus Hit? Or would you guys rather see Moro versus Kefla or a potential Super Saiyan 3 Kefla? The reason why I'm asking is because I really want to have, you know, somewhat of a fan incorporation of Moro versus someone from Universe 6. I thought to myself, you know what? Why not do Moro versus Hit who, you know, can use his assassination skills to his advantage or perhaps maybe if... You know, Moro were to invade Planet Sadala, since Planet Sadala, assumingly, would have a lot of energy for Moro to feast on. Can you imagine how crazy it would actually be to see Moro invade Planet Sadala and battle against Kaba, Kale, Khalifla, and then he overtakes them so much so that the girls are forced to fuse, and then they achieve Super Saiyan 3, right? I mean, I, I know it's a stretch, but in terms of power scaling, I, I want to get your thoughts on this, because... I, I don't know, I, I think this would be very dangerous for the fusions. Now, I, I know certain people are going to say in the comment section, well, no, Kefla's going to stomp. I'm not too sure about it. I think, I mean, look at the size difference. I think Moro would genuinely just either absorb their Genki or just stomp them the F out. So I, I want to do another a rematch between these two, except this time we're going to have Moro team up with somebody else. So... I, I wanted to run a few fan mangas, but I was just genuinely trying to think of, of a conceptual idea to do this. Well, oh my god. Super Saiyan 4 emerged Zamasu. If Zamasu was able to go SS4, can you imagine his potential craziness? So, uh, going back to the idea of Kefla. So, this would be interesting. So, let me add in Kefla. And on top of that, I'm going to add in our boy Ultra Instinct Omen Goku. So, I think, again... When you take a look at the overall possibility that, you know, this story has involving Moro and the potential going forward, I think it would be such a cool idea because we can sit here and just debate semantics all day. We can talk about, oh, what if Goku Black fought against, you know, battled against Hit? What if Moro invaded Universe 6? What if Broly was in the Tournament of Power? And that's what I feel like is very cool about this community is the fact that you can create all of these, like, really wacky what-ifs, but I think the most interesting one would be if somehow Moro had invaded Universe 6. Um, I mean, in terms of power scaling too, I want to know where you guys believe a potential Super Saiyan 3 Kefla would scale, you know, compared to UI Omen, and, you know, to, to, to just other characters within Universe 7, because I, I know a lot of people are going to say, well, she scales above Omen, she scales above Broly, I mean, think about it, Super Saiyan 3 Kefla, that would be 
that would be monster and, and and there's a reason why I did my thumbnail the way I did and I'm telling you all right now you're only gonna find content like this on this channel so big shout outs to all you guys that, that have supported me uh, all the way through to allow me to get this done for you so um, I, I just think that def Super Saiyan 3 Kefla at this point would probably be above Omen Goku from the TLP. I mean, if anything, largely above, but does she does she surpass Master Ultra Instinct? Hell no. I I, I don't think anybody does at this point, uh, minus the Angels, but um, Gen oh, also, by the way, I am working on a Maris mod, so expect to find that on the channel very, very soon. I'm gonna be the only one with an Angel Maris mod for this game, and it's all thanks to you guys. You guys wanted it, and I'm gonna make it happen. Also, you can expect Murno too. I'm working on a Murno mod. Um, speaking of Murno, do you guys also want to see Murno versus Universe Six? I, I, I guess, I guess for both uh, Moro and Murno, if you guys believe that, you know, it would be cool to. What, oh, wait a minute. Did oh, oh, Omen, Omen Goku? Did you take down Murza? You did. You son of a. Okay, let me, let me pick up Murzamasu. You failed once again. You had one job. And that's to destroy the mortals. And you now have the powers of Super Saiyan 4, and you failed me yet again. You know what? I'm gonna allow you to pick her up. Go ahead, pick her up. Oh, you're next. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so I I can see why Murzamasu had failed. Now Kefla's trying to defeat him, which I think is pretty interesting. So uh, either way, on top of that, uh, I also want to know if you guys would want to see a potential crossover of Moro and Murno. I'm not entirely sure how I would do that. Uh, I, I am taking into lots of people's uh, suggestions and stuff. Yo, Goku! Oh, I see what he did. I see what you did, mortal. Let me take down Kefla. Alright, where's 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 UI Goku? I need to put him out of his misery. So, again, uh, do you guys want to see Moral versus Hit? Or do you guys want to see Moral versus the Saiyans? Because I think with Hit, honestly, I, I don't I, I really don't want to downplay hit at all I, I i genuinely want to believe the idea that hit possesses the powers to you know kill people easily i i just find it incredible oh, damn moral took down goku with one freaking shot but i don't know unless hit is able to lock moro in the time cage and just use that against him then sure i think that maybe then he has a chance but i don't know you know what we're gonna test this theory out. Hold on. Let me see real quick, because I know he's somewhere. Where is... There he is. Our boy Hit. We're gonna have Hit team up with someone different here. Now, okay, this would be... This would be barbaric. I mean, hands down. Okay, so Super Saiyan Blue 3 Vegito, and we're gonna battle against Moro and a partner of his choice. Let's see. I mean, we have so many mods here, but either way on top of that... Oh, you know what? Yes young moro because a lot of people right i mean i i'm definitely one that agrees with the whole snout business right because i don't understand why they took that away from him but either way on top of that what i also want to know is the overall direction for this arc because i for one the possibilities are endless right but for me if i was writing this i mean at least for a from a fan manga's perspective i would definitely include a scenario to where you, you can do fusions, you can do so much, and I, I really think after thinking about it, what I might end up doing here, okay, hold on, so, uh, let me see if I can actually fight the current Moro, because the, the, the other Moro is desperately trying to attack me, so, oh my god, alright, well, I think for me, I, I think what I might do, honestly, is I might create, alright, let me, let me handle this Moro, while, hold on, I, I need Vegito to handle the older Moro. All right, so I, I think what I might do, honestly, is I, I really might do, I can, can you imagine this right here, right? Like imagining hit using time skip against the current Moro would be crazy. So let me, I, and that's what's interesting about this. Let me see, oh, there we go. I mean, some of these attacks, man, like the one thing I'm questioning right now is if hits time cage would be able to actually, you know, do, do some sort of justice against Moro. Like can the actual time cage be something that could actually, you know, destroy Moro in just one shot, right? So let me see. I don't know. I mean, stopping his heart is another thing because we saw the way Hit tried that against Jiren, and J oh, it's it's done. Th this fight is a wash. Watch this. Oh, this fight is a wash. Can I actually? I want to see if I can use my my uh, my Tokito Bush. I want to see if I could use that because 
Hit never gets any recognition in Super. I mean, after the Universe 6 arc, it was like, all right, well, he just became, you know, a, just a basic nobody, right? Oh, damn it. I, I was going to use my attack there for a second. Hold on. I, 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 I was going to... I was gonna blitz my way around, but clearly enough, this version of Moro's, uh, he, he, he's clearly having the upper hand against me. Let me see if I can actually put him out of his misery. I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised that Vegito is is able to hold his own. Oh, that sucks. Which is how, how did that even happen? After the Universe 6 arc, though, it's like they didn't really give Hit any justice, right? I mean, slap a like down below if you guys agree, because the fight with Jiren could have been so much better. I mean, first of all, I, I, I think I speak on behalf of everyone when I say they got rid of Hit way too early. They got rid of the man way too early. I, I understand he was supposed to be used as like a stepping stone for Jiren, but I mean, even afterwards, right, we, we saw his great potential. So for me personally, I want to, I, I really want to see what would happen if uh, if Hit was involved in this. I, I, I need to time skip him. I, I, I really need to time skip this dude because I have no idea what's happening. Oh, okay. Oh, we got him. Time skip. There we go. That, that was a nice, that was a really nice time skip. Hold on. I need, I need Vegito. Where, where did, where did, oh, there he is. I need a my boy Vegito for this one. Uh, okay. This, this may not, this may not cut the mustard, honestly, but let me see. Hold on. I, I, I need to like dance my way around here. Oh, this is bad. I, I, I need to, I need to use an item. Come on, hit. I'm telling you all right now, hit, hit time skip. I think would work, but it, it, it's it's a matter of adaption. It's like okay, the question here would be, can Moro ultimately adapt to what the heck hit is doing, right? I mean, it's 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 an interesting question because it's like all right, well, we've seen Goku do it, so why can't Moro? Like in that particular circumstance, right? How the hell did he just? There we go. Ooh, right through the. Hold on. How the hell did he just endure that? I mean, you guys, you guys saw that, right? Oh, this is, this is not looking good right now for me, Chief. And I'm really, I'm really trying to play coy. Let me see. I mean, I, I, I genuinely want to believe that this attack could stop Moro's heart, right? But I mean, I, I, I don't know. I think for me, his assassination skills should get him far enough to do that. But if I'm wrong, I, then I guess I'm wrong. Because, I mean, you are going to have people that are going to try to, like, debate that, you know? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, crap. All right, hold on. I need to I need to use as many items as I can because I know Homeboy is pretty strong. Let me see. But, I mean, let me know in the comment section below if you guys want to see Kefla versus Moro, if you guys want to see Hit versus Moro, and um, I guess the same thing applies. Oh, is he finished? I, I think he is. Okay. All right, you. This is the only one left. Hold him there. Hold him there. Hold on. Let, let me let me power up. Let me end him with my with my time skip. I mean, that is unless this Moro is strong enough to overcome. You know what? Oh, there we go. You know what? Hold on. Hold on. And and we're oh, there. We got him. We got him. We got him right with the time skip. That was a beautiful finish. He's still alive somehow. Ah, oh, look at that. Oh, how the tides have turned. And now, I mean, listen. The ball, far, the ball falls in our court, so Hit and Vegito take the victory. But again, I want to get your thoughts and feedback for a potential fan manga involving Universe 6 versus Moro. And again, thank you all so much for your time. If, if, if you guys enjoyed, slap a like down below because I want to do so much, but it's just a matter of trying to figure out like where to actually start. So your feedback, your suggestions, everything is actually very useful to me. So again, thank you all so much for your time. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, slap a big fat like down below. Tune back in for more if there are any other mod requests you guys want or any other mods you guys want to see, then simply let me know in the comment section below. Thank you all so much once more, and I'll be seeing each and every single one of you guys down in the comment section below. Have a great day, everybody, and take care. Peace. This is the Galactic Emperor of the Universe, and of course I'm here to tell you to subscribe to Unrelent Gaming. Also follow Unrelent Gaming on these social media platforms to stay connected at all times. And if you don't, then very soon you will all be dead! <laughs> oh, did someone say Unrelent Gaming? Oh my god! The fuck, Zabon? Put on some clothes! Well, why don't you put on any clothes? What? I don't need clothes! Jesus Christ, that's huge! <laughs> What, Broly? Breezer. Uh-oh. Prepare to die! <laughs> <laughs> boo, I'm a real gimmick! But once you get video, I'll lots of likes! Or Boo will turn you into chocolate! Vados, get over here! Tell these mortals...
announces that I'm the biggest Unreal Engine gaming fan. This is my moment. I'm a part of his notification squad. Universe 7 can have all the fun. I just want the food. And don't forget to leave a comment on this video. Show some love for the best community on YouTube. <laughs> K -k 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 -k